boom, baby. My name is Peter Robinson, aka 1000. I make music under the moniker of Peace Move. I'm a painter and a designer. I do paintings and sell paintings. Um, and today we're going to be doing one of those paintings. Show you a little bit of my process. It's going to be cool. <laughs> Art Supplies U District. Right now we're driving to the U District to one of my favorite art supply stores. We're gonna, I need to get some more white paint. I use a lot of white paint. Um, and I want to pick up a couple more colors, random colors. And some fat tipped India ink pens so that I can get the super thick lines. Uh, 102.14. To the uh, Value Village in Ballard. They usually have some good stuff there. You can't like go out there expecting to find a certain piece because it's totally dictated by what has been donated to um, the thrift store that I'm in at the time, or what the vin whatever vintage store, whatever those people have found at rubber sales or flea markets or where or storage units. So it kind of starts with the background. And that's going to dictate you. It's like when I make music and I work with the sample. It's like the sample, you don't can't really anticipate what you're going to find. But once that you find it, you know what it is. And it's going to dictate how you're going to continue creating from that point on. Good morning, shoppers. And welcome to Ballard Goodwill. Where today all greet and are just $8.29. Any greed that you do find in any department of our store will be just a dollar twenty-nine, regardless of the market price. When I'm out in stores, if I see seven or eight different pieces that I think could be a cool idea in the future, I just buy them. So my house is just full of like frames, and <laughs> I have like tons and tons of frames and canvases and stuff. It looks like some like old woman's storage unit or something in there. <laughs> so this is my, sort of my cache of <laughs> canvases. I've gotten a little bit fanatical about just checking in on the stores and seeing if there's anything cool. I'm basically like, I'm not really in it for the imagery. I'm in it for like the tones and the colors in the background. I like to have these really rich kind of like jaded, muted yellows and greens and reds because my characters and my art is so like bright, vibrant. Sort of like muted, earth tone, rich reds and yellows and browns in the background. And there's just like these super bright, vibrant characters. Somebody in Renton, Washington painted this. I'm gonna paint over it. <laughs> and that's just like prime candidate to get painted over. We'll set this one aside. I think I wanna work on this one today. squirrel. <laughs> Patchy. Well, this guy's gonna be the centerpiece, but there's gonna be more stuff going on around it. When you start adding the details, that's when it really kind of starts coming to life. Hey, what's up, Rick? Hey, man, I just saw a free park. You got out here. Let me get the link real quick. Are you there? 
Yeah. Okay, cool. Call me when you're up front. Alright, peace. Peace. I just found free parking. Yo, what's up? My name is Rick Root. Um, I'm here on behalf of my homeboy Peace Move with the uh, Ten Hunt Art Movement. Uh, he's doing his thing, you know, we, I'm in a, in a group with him called Fresh Espresso, we make hip hop music, uh, and yeah, this dude's a, he's, a, he's an artist, man, on all facets, you know, I've seen just canvases and stuff before he decided to even put them out, so it's good to see the art flourish, uh, yeah. I feel like he's like, this dude is like a false prophet or something, like, Thinks that he can come to Ray and shit. Like these are his little followers, but he's really just fake. <laughs> maybe, maybe not. I think that's a little too dark. <laughs> False prophet. It's been good to me. 